Hey guys and welcome back to Rogue Legacy. Uh, we cut it short last time because it was a very long video, about 20 something minutes. So we're going to keep drawing on 5 runs instead of 10 like I said. Last time we unlocked all of these. Upgraded the Barbarian and the Paladin. And did pretty well for ourselves. We're currently playing as uh, Lady Steffi and the Paladin. Who I think has got dementia? Not too sure, I think she has. Let's see how we go. Take a drink of my brand which I'm not allowed to say softly. Even though this isn't money type so I can say it all. It's Coca-Cola, I like it. I endorse Coca-Cola. They don't give me any money though. Uh, I'm falling. But again, what we're trying to do in this is trying to get as much money to upgrade our things, get as many runes as we can. We do want to be getting runes though, and getting them as quick as possible. As well as we do not want to mess about, we want to try and get the good upgrades first. So then what do I mean by good upgrades? Like in the castle, we want to we want to go for the class upgrades as quick as possible because they get expensive fast. The more you get, the, the more expensive they get. Because when you get about 10, it goes up by 100, which is annoying. And this should be a, a lot of money. So it's going to be a rune or something, but no, money will do good. Ah, oh, Gasly hit me. Gasly, you tackle. Lady Steffi, and use the slash. Bounce. A miss. Oh, I got dash. Yeah, I got the dash rune, didn't I? Another big thing. Dash rune. Very nice one. Very, ni very nice one, yes. And bounce. Good. And slide. Slide. Slash. Slide. Move more slide. Slide. We have some gold, some chicken, and slide. 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 Break and slide. Break, break, jump, slide. Jump, break. Break, slide. See, what's, uh, see this is why I love sliding. You can just slide over those gaps. Ow, oh, I thought I could slide behind like some sort of dodge mechanic. But I forgot. <laughs> forgot this was Rogue Legacy. There's no such forest. <coughs> yes, there is no such forest. This will take us to the forest. We've seen the Maya and the Land of Darkness. This is the forest. This is effectively level 2 of this game. So this is the direct sort of difficulty increase from the past one. There are quite still a few. Oh, what level are these? Uh, the levels vary. These are level 16, so they shouldn't give us too much trouble. That's that dead. That's that dead. See, most enemies are still down in one or two hits. But that's because of the type of enemies that we're facing. See, look, they do 35 damage to us. They do a lot more damage. And kill Plinky? No, we didn't. We merely wounded him. Tis but a flesh wound. Okay, so you can luckily we can jump on these little platforms. This is where some other runes would be useful, but we don't have them yet. We have them unlocked, we just don't physically have them. Oh, that's a bad jump. This is a, oh, that's a good jump, actually. Yeah, okay, we made it. Yeah, I thought we were going to take damage on one of those jumps. We have a freaking bloob. Kill the bloob. We've got a f upgraded version of those fire magician things. Luckily we can't shoot through that wall, which is a godsend. Do you manage to kill him? Kill, not kill him. I managed to hurt him quite a bit. Blade wall. Any enemy which passes through the blade wall gets hurt. Unfortunately, it doesn't block projectiles, which I think it did. Which I am most should, in my opinion. Kill the blaze lock. Good. We're actually doing better than I do when, high, in a, when I'm higher levels. For some reason. Makes them more of a conflict when, I go out when I'm a higher level. Because I'm playing Alt Slave because I know like two hits are going to kill me instantly. And kill. And we have a lot, lot gold. So we've already broke a thousand, which is incredible for this stage of the game. We're going to ignore him. You don't tend to get much for completing a room outright. Those guys are annoying as hell. Oh god. We want to get what go on out of it. Like sharpish. Ugh. That 
lots of dwarf over there, see it's slightly faded, that's where dwarves can go, but we're not a dwarf. So we can't go there. So we've made it to the chest. We have another ton of gold. Oh dear. Dodge. Okay, well now we're going to take these guys out. Not quite dead. These Furies are level 30, this is a problem, because these guys are pretty strong. Ow. Play ball. And it killed us. The, the uh, Fury killed us. We did well though, we haven't even beaten the first boss, we haven't even seen the first boss, and we're going into places we shouldn't be going into yet. At a, way at a much lower level than we should. We gained a lot of gold there, um, from Lady Stephine. We've got another four runs after this. Who to play as? Do we have a dwarf? No. Who to play as? We are to play as... A colorblind knave. Okay, how much gold do we have? We are going to upgrade the mage. And unlock the shinobi. The sh if, this, if this is the shinobi, I think it is. Favourite character of all time is the shinobi because it deals a ton of damage. And when I say a ton, I mean the shinobi deals massive damage. Okay, from here we could upgrade some other things, but I'm not going to. I'm going to save money for armour and stuff. See, we're colourblind. This knave's colourblind. And we also have the Shakaram, which is a very nice spell. Or the um, the Tron Blade, as we've as we discovered last time. Anything we want to unlock here? Um, we could get some knight. Yeah, we're going to get some of these knight limbs. It gives a bit of extra armour, a bit of extra health. Let's go in there. We're going to lose a lot of gold. We're going to lose all of our gold strong. Unfortunately. I'm going to take another sip of my uh, red can of Coca-Cola. If anyone's wondering why I don't drink bottles, because they're expensive. <coughs> no, Physios. I am recording. Go away. I'm not that popular. I get my friends always wanting to play games with me when I'm recording. It gets rather irritating. But yeah, I'm doing this in one sitting, so... Your tips and tricks won't help me until my next recording session. Which I don't know when it's going to be. Ooh. Probably going to be uh, after this episode. I'm going to do maybe two episodes a session. Doom Vast, hate you. Ow. Wow, that somehow fed through me. Okay, let's kill this guy off. Or miss. Oh, we can just ground pound Goomba stomp him. Let's go. Who you slide? Break. Bounce. Bounce. Jump. Shacker him. Go Tromblade, go. Break. 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 Slide. Jump. Slide. Slide. Oh, that didn't hit. Good thing we can jump on multiple ways. Hey! Okay, so we're doing quite well now. We're gonna have to just jump up here. Try not get hit by the skeletons. Skeletons, skeletons, Jack Skeleton. And we've got another cath um, carnival. We found one last time. It's, I think it's the same game each time. I don't know. And uh, we have to use ten daggers to destroy eight targets. So it is the same. Who? Huh. Hit. Who? Huh. Hit. Who? Huh. Hit. Who? Huh. Miss. Hit. Miss. Hit. Miss. Okay, no, we're not going to do it there. We're going to wait. And we're going to jump now. Throw. Damn it. Jump. Throw. Damn it. Throw. Damn it. Throw. And we failed. Oh, so that's the closest I've ever gotten to actually winning it then. Couldn't hit any targets. Good dog. No. I'll kill you if I could. But for some reason I can't. Okay, let's jump. Slash. Down slash. Down slash. Ow. Jump. Down stab. Take damage. Jump. Down stab. Jump. Slide. Eh. Eh. Ah, that killed us because I'm stupid. That was a very poor run. By our other run standards. <coughs> we have a barbarian queen. 
an archmage or an archmage. Who are we gonna play? We are playing as this archmage. Archmage's ability, um, like the Paladin Shield. The Archmage's actual ability, uh, we're gonna go for the crit chance up here. The Archmage's ability is that he can see he has a three spells at his arsenal, and you, he uses A to cycle through him. So we have the Chakram, the knife, and time freeze. A time freeze is a constant. So as long as we have it up, it's gonna drain about 15 MP per second, or something like that. So, but this is a very good one because we we have remember things with extreme clarity. Um, so we can remember where the enemies are. Like it'll show them on the map as red blobs. And we are we have pretty much roid rage, so we knock enemies very far away with our attacks, which is good for getting them. We're just getting rid of them really. So our current aim is to just try and find more runes. That worked. Smash you. Also, as a mage, every single kill you get gives you mana. Which is very nice. Okay, let's scad shoot. Slide. Slide. Break, drop. Drop, break, drop. Drop. Track him, drop. Jump, break, jump. Jump, jump, break, jump, break, jump, slash, slide. Oh, okay, we're not gonna make it to this one, I don't think. Yeah, we've not made it. Unless we... Oh, we did make it! Yes, we made it to a fairy chest. We have a rune. A sky rune. That's amazing to find. That pretty much gives us the ability of flight. Actually, I could have used our time stop ability there. That probably would have helped. Just make sure we've killed off most of these enemies. Just because they caused me trouble and nearly stopped me from getting that fairy chest. That should do, I don't want to risk going past that in case it gets a stupid death. We're probably going to die here. Simply because I don't like these spike balls. They're annoying. Okay, we made it through there without a hitch, now we have to get through here. I just wasted a, a dagger. Slide. Okay, but that's all we have in here is just some potions and such. Which is very nice. Break. Slide. 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 Okay, let's see. Uh. 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 No. Yes. Just. Oh, frames. Uh. 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 <laughs> Got him. Good throw. So we are going to want to get. Oh, I don't know. Quite a bit. We, we mainly want runes and uh, blueprints. Oh, this is like a boss guy. Sit down. Throw. Oh, he jumped. He dodged me. It's going to get him on the turn hit, I think. And that killed the one hit. So there dies Sir Lancelot, killed slain by a McRib. Who do you? Who to play as? We can play as a knave or a shinobi. Oh, I love the shinobi. Shinobi deals massive damage, a ton of damage, but he can't do critical strikes. I mean, we were doing about 20 hit normally. Now we're doing about 47. Please tell me we can afford the sky rune on the cape. Damn it, we're a bit short. 350. Ev for every rune you buy, it gets a bit more expensive. Uh, it's, uh, I think it's for every piece of equipment you buy. It I think the equipment st stays the same, I don't know. What do we want here? Is there anything we should buy? Is that 7 damage? Might as well buy it, because we're going to lose all our gold. Might as well buy a better sword. Have we got it equipped? I think we should. We should do. Yeah, we have it equipped. Nice. Unfortunately, I've got one of my my least favourite spells, which is the goddamn these things. They're useless in my opinion. Yeah. And the Shinobi is also the fastest character. I mean, look how fast he moves. I mean, 
he's just lightning fast. damage. Oh, what? Invincibility frames. Well, we are quite low health here. It's never good. One hit kill. Jump. And kill. Kill. Going good so far. We just need to replenish our health somehow. Bounce. Bounce. Break that. Move in and kill. I know how people are going to be saying, they, they won't be saying because no one comments, but <laughs> you, should get, you guys should comment. People will be saying that I should be breaking everything. Sometimes it's just, I seriously just can't be bothered and I know that's lazy of me and I am a really person. But it's a case of, oh that hurt. Ah, oh, this hurts as well. We need some more chicken, right now. Really, now, chicken, please. We're gonna want to be careful here. He's gonna be the guy who's probably most likely gonna kill us. Let me get him out of the way. Followed by him. Him. Is this, a, this looks like a. No, it's not. It's not an annoyance. We have a room full of enemies. Got that's dead. Jump. Kill him as we come down. And kill. Open the chest, we have. 210 gold in that one chest. Collect, collect this gold. Uh, we're, not, we're doing good, but we're not doing good enough in my mind. Ooh. That's super ghastly. Oh, he's gonna charge at us. Luckily, we managed to knock him back. And we killed him. Uh, that was effectively a mini boss. We've got. Ooh, quite a bit of gold. Don't know how much there. But we are getting a l oh, <laughs> if that was that hit us, we would have been dead. Okay, we want to go. We're gonna want to go up there because we haven't been there yet. If you wonder what that question mark is, that's where the fountain was. The fountain regains us health and mana. Okay, this is bad. Don't let rooms where it's filled with these things. The Maya, good. This means gonna be some mana here and some health. We're gonna go into the Maya because we're a shinobi. We'll be able to pretty much one hit everything up here. Aside from these, those super enemies. So we're gonna head up here, break some stuff. Get as much gold as physically possible. Can we break that chain? No. Is it doing vast? No. We have a spell in here. The Quantum Dance Looter. To be honest, I prefer it to this. I prefer it to the, um. To what we had before. Just because it's useful, it can save your life, that thing can't. Okay, look. Kill off Rage. Rage against the machine. Ooh! Come on, come on, come on. Oh, damn it, hit me as I hit him. Well, that's the death of this, of the sh that's the Sir Hershey, the death of Sir Hershey. Killed a lot of enemies and a big mini boss as well. So how many have we played as? Sir Hero. We played as five in the first one. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. This is the last one for this episode, guys. I'm sorry if it's a bit short, but, yeah. We are going to play as a shinobi again, because God loves a shinobi. We're gonna want, we need to get to Haggle. But as you can see, that's a very expensive upgrade. If you're wondering why we need it, at least to the upgrade for the shinobi, like the equivalent upgrade like to what the pa upgrade in the palace would be. That's what, like, you know, where you can upgrade the barbarian to the barbarian king or queen, the arch, the mage to the archmage, so on and so forth. And now we have the sky, now we have the cape. Can we afford the vault room? No. The vault room would give us double jump if we had enough for it, but we don't. So phooey.
Do we have any more of the night or blood? Any blood armor? What does this do? This gives us plus four critical chance for Shinobi. We don't have to worry about that. We also have the axe, which is Will's favorite thing. Oh no! We, we, this guy, um, I forget what he's got. Uh, he's got this. He's got a thing. If you wonder why we don't have a health bar, this guy is just sort of, sort of one of his traits is the fact that we cannot see how much health we have because he doesn't feel pain. So he doesn't know how near to death he is, which is really weird. It's weird because you're always sort of going to play as if you're low health. Yes, he sets up spike traps. Defeat all enemies for a fairy chest. This actually might be one we can take out. Uh, just. We're not going to be able to reach that one. How do you get that one? Seriously. <coughs> <coughs> Smash, 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 jump, press tab, jump, slide, tab opens your map by the way, that's what I just did there, there's the map, now land on that, that's my fault, that's the first hit we took, Ah, Doom Vassers. That's another Doom Vassers over there. There's my one hit. Let's take the sky up. Oh look, we can fly. That's the Skyrim working its job. It happens when you jump, and when after you've jumped, like, it's after you've used up all your jumps. If you jump again, it'll activate flying. We can fly for... I don't know. I don't even know what that count, like, what sort of time that count counts down in. I don't think it's milliseconds because I can count to one the time he does it. But one, two. So I don't know. But this is the boss. We are going to take on the boss. Why? No idea. We are going to die while we're doing this. But we have a reasonable amount of gold. We have the knight chest plate. I wouldn't mind getting a bit more gold actually trying to get up to that 900 mark. Which I think we're going to do before we engage the boss. But we'll know where he is and we can also teleport there whenever we want. Now, uh, we're going to want to take as little damage as we can since we are going to fight the boss. And we're, we're, we might need to accumulate some mana. Slice. I thought we're just going to want to go. Wanna go wanna go uh, gu 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 going to want to go for a thousand. Because at a thousand, uh, we will definitely have enough. So upgrade that. And if you can get more than that, it's just a bonus. Okay, that's done. That's the flying working for us. It's also very good to combine um, flying with slide. Like I said, that's going to make it much safer. Just to get up here. Up here, smash this. 100 gold, we're getting very close now. We can get uh, uh, another 3 of them, we'll be good. Kill. Get gold. Jump, slide, fly. Jump, smash, smash, slide. And now we're gonna go down. We're just trying to get to that magic a thousand, like the magic number of a thousand. That's dental's dead. We're at, we're at, we're pretty much at nine hundred now. Careful these skeletons, because they can be very annoying. Well, hopefully this chest is going to have enough gold. And it does. Okay, we now have enough to get what we need. To get Haggle. 
Haggle makes it so we don't have to give up all our gold, most of it. We just have to go up like 94%, I think. But now I feel safe to it. Well, not safe, but I feel okay to engage the boss. We're, pr we're pretty much a certain to fail, but I feel like showing them off on the last run of this one to show us what our main target is. Oh, little diddy thing. No. Meet Kadir, the Watcher, the Gatekeeper, even. Kadir is going to be our ultimate death. Uh. Uh. Smack, smack. Actually, we could get him. Mostly because we're doing so much damage to the Shinobi. Oh my god, I've got my half health. Okay, this is this is annoyance. This is death. That's death. We had him so close to death, but guys, that's the end of this this episode. I think I'm gonna do one more tonight, and that, I think I'm gonna do one more in this session. That's gonna be it. I'll see you guys later.